Hi, my name is David Mesopan. I'm running for sophomore class president. My teachers and peers, I'd like to think most of them, see me in class as a student, as a very diligent student who uh, gets their work done, but also tries to retain the knowledge uh, he thinks is important and understands that not everything we learn in the classroom is very important, but the stuff that is important, uh, he, I try to re uh, remember. And as a person, I think they see me as uh, a good person, and now that I think of it, that means a lot, because a good person cares about their classmates and uh, what they think of them, and they always want to show them that, especially in terms of leadership, that they can uh, lead their class and have their year be a very good year. Um, and as a leader, again, they see me as one, as I think, a very um, a capable leader who's had experience and that can do the same things better and new things uh, very well. What motivates me to do well is I know that if I don't do something well, it doesn't help anybody, whether it's uh, a homework assignment or something <clears throat> for Spirit Week or organizing a dance or a fundraiser or anything like that. I know that if I don't do a good job, it not only might not affect anybody, but it might uh, affect others and myself negatively. And if I motivate myself to do a good job, I know that it's going to affect people positively. They're going to have a good time. I can get their mind off of something that they don't want to be thinking about right now. And as sophomore class president, if I do a good job at anything, then my class will be affected positively and their year will be ten times better. If I'm elected, I would see my job First off, winning Spirit Week, throwing together the best, one of the best winter balls any high school has ever seen, and also helping out the freshmen next year because even if you're not in leadership as a freshman, just as a freshman in high school, there's a pretty steep learning curve, I think, and I think that the sophomores especially, since they're freshman years, uh, fresh in their minds, they can help out uh, the incoming uh, freshmen. And also, I recently went to this event with Leadership in Interact called We Day, and I thought to myself, at the event were a bunch of schools who had done amazing things and Washington is really special. We do so many fundraisers and different things and we always give back to the community. But I feel like in high school that's the one of the best points in anyone's life where you can actually go out and help people and fit that into your regular schedule with homework and extracurricular activities. You can go out and make these fundraisers that are a little difficult to put together but not too difficult and I just want to help more people instead of just leading my class. I really want to make sure, first off, that the sophomore year for class of 2018 is amazing, and my second uh, priority would, I would love to help more people as much as I can, because as soon as I'm out of high school, I'll be busy with my own things and won't have much of a chance to help me. So again, my name is David Mesopan. I'm running for sophomore class president. Hello, my name is Isaac Gordon. I'm running for the sophomore class vice president, uh, class of 2018. Well, I have people skills, so I'll, I'm a really good communicator. So if, if I want to talk to somebody, well, if I want to talk to somebody, then I can figure out what they have I, 
what ideas they have in mind, so I can figure out the group consensus of what everybody wants to do. So I can figure out like where the group wants to go and help them get there. And I can also delegate work to others. I can I work myself, but I can make everybody work the same amount. Like. So nobody's slacking off, nobody's handling all the work by themselves. Uh, I work on my own very well because I'll delegate all my time, man I'll manage my time well. So I'll think, oh, I have to do this task, I have an hour to do this task, I need to get it done by then, and 30 minutes to do this so I can get it done by the deadline. And I'll brainstorm my, brainstorm my ideas first and see which one would be best suited for the idea. So in a group, I'll be able to delegate work evenly so everybody works the same amount. As sort of a co-president, so me, the president and I would both help out around school and campus and make the school, using new ideas that we'd think up, uh, we'd make the school a better place for the generation now and the generations to come. Oh, for me, for class of 2018, VP. Hi, I'm Jessica Manhart, and I'm running for a sophomore class vice president. I think I'd be a, a good choice for this job because uh, I work really well with others, and um, I'm really I want to be a part of the school and be able to help with anything I can, and just make this four years fun for not only myself but for everyone who comes to the school. And um, I always I can stay on task and I always complete a job I'm given and I'm very passionate about this sort of thing and just being involved with everyone and um, I work very hard and um, yeah and uh, I also um, not afraid to talk in front of a crowd or interact with my fellow classmates and um, yeah, so I feel I would be, I have many skills for this job and to do it well. <laughs> I can, I work well with others because I'm always open to new ideas and everyone's opinion. I don't just shut people out right away. I think everyone has um, opinions that are helpful and useful and I try to incorporate everyone's um, ideas and everything into what we're working on and it's always nice uh it's like a learning experience working with others and it's just really nice seeing what other people have to say and just that sort of thing uh i also can work by myself which sometimes is easier because you can get things done faster and stuff so i i'm very independent but at the same time uh I like working with others. I guess I'm just kind of a people person and I like being with other people. So uh, yeah, I can do well. I can do both well. Uh, if I were to be elected as my class vice president, I would see myself, um, I guess, interacting with the students a lot and um, kind of being the person who is talks to the people, not just behind the scenes, but um, the person in front of everyone saying things and just helping out with all the um, duties that were given and helping out with the president and making choices and decisions with that and then just the leadership the leadership class and just helping uh, well, making uh, the decisions and uh, just everything like that and just being able to incorporate everyone's thoughts and ideas on everything and being able to just do my job. And I'm Jessica Manhard and I really hope that you'll give me a chance to be your sophomore class vice president. Hi, I'm Nicholas Nguyen and I'm running for your sophomore class treasurer. I play soccer, which is a team sport, so I've learned a lot about cooperation and teamwork through that. And my mom works in the financial industry, so I have really learned about the understanding of the value of money and just knowing how to budget and spend things properly and I feel like this background knowledge will help me become a better treasurer if I'm elected. I am a really hard worker, I'm organized and I'm really passionate about the school and my motivation to do well is to just help Washington reach its full potential.
I know that um, the treasurer takes care of all the financial um, stuff for our class and they manage the money and the budget and just make sure that they don't overspend so there's enough money for future events. Hi Huskies, I'm Nicholas Nguyen and vote for me as your sophomore class treasurer.